Alrighty guys, Matt here, Mr. Matt Darnell, and here in this video I'm going to show you guys how you can get AVG, uh, Internet Security 2016 for free. Alrighty guys, let's go ahead and let's get started. So the first thing you're going to need to do is you're going to need to download the torrent in the description. Uh, the torrent will be updated, so I will update update the links in the description below. However, I will also be leaving the original files like I did with the CCleaner video. I'll have an original link to the original torrent that I used uh, in the description below as well. However, keep in mind that link may not always work, but I will keep the links updated. So once you have that torrent downloaded, you should get a folder like this named AVG2016 Final. If we go ahead and we open this up, we have an activation folder, AVG Antivirus 2016, AVG Internet Security 2016, AVG Remover, along with the manuals for AVG Internet Security and Antivirus. Let's go ahead and let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is once you're in this folder here, if you want antivirus, go ahead and load up the antivirus there. If you want internet security, go ahead and choose internet security here. I'll be showing you guys how you can do the internet security. Go ahead and right click this and run as administrator. Give it a second to load and click yes here. It's going to go ahead and extract our AVG setup here. This will be the same process if you uh, want to use AVG antivirus instead of internet security. Same process, just use a different setup program. Put this to the side here. And as you can see, we have our AVG setup here. In this case, this is Welcome to AVG Internet Security. Of course, if you choose AVG Antivirus, you'll see Welcome to AVG Antivirus. Go ahead and click Custom Installation here. And when you see Enter Your License Number, go ahead and go to Activation Folder here. Next, go to our Keygen here. Next, you want to mute your volume, you will thank me later. Go ahead and right click and run it as an administrator. Click yes. And we get this window right here. Go ahead and click on this drop down box right here. If you have internet security, go ahead and choose AVG Internet Security 3 pack. Uh, if you want to use AVG Antivirus, go ahead and choose AVG Antivirus. Just make sure you do not choose AVG Antivirus free if you're choosing the Antivirus Edition. Make sure you choose AVG Antivirus. If you're doing Internet Security, once again go ahead and choose Internet Security 3 pack is what I will be using. Once you choose that, go ahead and press Generate. You can go ahead and copy this right here. And we can paste it right in here. To paste, go ahead and do Control V. You'll see success. Go ahead and click continue. Click install now. And as you can see, it will download and install. It's going to download the newest updates. However, if you have the updated torrent, it should not download anything. And if it does, it should not take more than a second. Uh, once again, it, this will update. You can update this. Uh, we're using a key, so you can update this. You can update the virus definitions. You can update the program version. And when 2017 comes out next year, provided your key uh, is still good, which it should be, you should be able to update to 2017 as well. And if not, I will have a video updated by then showing you guys the updated version. And if at any time, for some reason, your product is deactivated, you can just go ahead and run that again, and you can get a new key. If it says those keys are invalid, you can try a key from one of these text documents that should be included. As well as I will have a list of keys in the description below. That should work as well. You can go ahead and close that folder out. We should not need that folder anymore. You can go ahead and delete this folder. You shouldn't need this unless you want to remove AVG. Go ahead and keep one of these remove AVG removers. Go ahead and drag this one out here and I'll keep this AVG remover for later. It's going to go ahead and install AVG for us. Alrighty guys, now once the installation is completed, you will get a screen saying install complete. Go ahead and click finish here. 
and we can load up AVG protection here. You'll notice that it says you are not fully protected. This means that we are out of date here. We can just go ahead and click that fix now button and it will download and install updates. As you can see here, it's going to download and install the newest updates from AVG. It's going to fix that for us. You can fix your performance. Uh, this does include the PC tune-up as well. And internet security includes your antivirus. Uh, it should include anti-malware, web protection, ID protection, email, firewall, all that good stuff. Uh, reports here. Update completed successfully, and you'll notice that we are protected successfully. Under support here, you can get our support. You'll see our license number, product name, all that good stuff, product information, program information, license agreement. Down here, we can go to about AVG, find out the same information. And down here we can update this. As you can see it has updated, no problem whatsoever, still activated. We can go ahead and update from directory, it's still going to uh, update. And if we go to my account, should load up your activation information there. Hope this guy hope this helped you out guys. Hope you guys stay clear from viruses and spyware and all that junk on the internet. Hope this keeps you safe. I will have a video up soon showing you guys um, other antivirus programs that you can use as well. AVG is typically the preferred antivirus program for most people. Uh, I know it's a very popular one out there and it's editor's choice for a lot of websites out there. So I thought I'd begin with showing you guys how you can get this program for free. This is not personally what I use. I will show you guys what I use for antivirus in a different video. However, AVG Internet Security is a pretty good solid option. Hope this helped you out. Like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Till next time, guys. I'll see you later.